What's up, YouTube? Uh, this is Beastie1066 with a, another review. Um, today's review is going to be on my EPK system or my emergency preparedness kit. And uh, if you hear any noise in the background, excuse that. It's my little brother here. Um, say hi, Jacob. Hi. So my little brother. Um, but if you hear any noise in the background, it's him, so don't worry about it. Um, I'm going to start with the review. Uh, it's on my EPK system. And um, this kit basically varies between, uh, I mean, uh, depends on where I'm going. If I'm going to school, I put things that I can bring to school in here. If not, I put things that I could use on a daily basis. So uh, that's why it says contents vary. So now I'm going get to get started on the kit. Uh, first of all, um, this is the utility knife that I uh, carry along with this kit. It's my Gerber Mini uh, tactical pocket knife. And uh, this is just a small little utility knife. I need to cut something like a box or maybe cut open a package. This will do the job. It's uh, very, very sharp. So um, this is the knife I'll be carrying with me uh, with this kit uh, other, besides school. Other than that, if, um, if, I don't have, if I don't have my other knives on me, I'll have this one with me because it always goes with this kit. So yeah, this is the ut utility knife that I carry with me. All right, so the next next thing to do, I'm gonna crack open the the container. So as you see here, it's a it's a clamshell opening. Uh, it's got six compartments: one large, one two medium sized, and three small ones. And uh, everything that I carry here fits nicely in each pocket. I mean, there there's a little bit of bulge, but when you fold it and lock it down, it holds everything pretty nicely. There you go, and nothing will pop out. So. That's why I chose this kit. Uh, I got it from my mom. I think it's uh, an, an earring container or whatever. But yeah, it works works nice for this. And um, you know, it's in pink. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna get started with the larger compartment first, and I'll move over to this side later. So here we go. Um, the uh, the top here, they are removable. So I'll take that off for you and uh, review the things that are on the inside. So the first thing you see on the top is a pair of tweezers. You know for uh, splinters or uh, stings that you get maybe on a daily basis pair of tweezers will do the job uh, next item which I thought fits perfectly in this kit and um, it's an excellent tool is a pair of fingernail clippers these are the uh, the toddler uh, version they're they're smaller more compact than the regular size uh, fingernail clippers they're from the brand Gerber so um, I thought I'd pick, pick out these ones because of my baby brother, he doesn't use these anymore. So I thought I'd use these rather than the larger uh, clip fingernail clippers because just a lot of bulk and it won't fit in this little container here. So thought I'd choose that. All right. So moving on, the next item is 100 mile an hour tape. It's just like duct tape, but it's uh, stronger. I mean, it'll last longer, hold things longer than duct, regular duct tape. And all it is is uh, rolled on a car, and that's about five feet, maybe two or three feet. But yeah, I always keep a good amount of uh, tape on me, whether it be duct tape, masking tape, or electrical tape. Always have tape on me. It's all, I also have some in my wallet, um, which I have a review on that in my EDC update. Uh, I carry it in my wallet. And um, this is another card. You'll see another one of these in that video. But this is another card that I just thought I'd roll some on there. You know, yeah. I always have tape on me. Uh, I mean, if there's a leak in like a, a cup, like uh, one time my mom was at Starbucks and there was a leak in her cup and we had already left and we just discovered it. It was leaking into our cup holder. And I was like, here, mom, tape it up with this. So it's perfect. Well, not the exact tape, but it was a pair of some duct tape. But tape works very well. You should always have tape on you no matter what. All right, moving on. Um, for school reasons, you know, because it started getting annoying how girls always ask you, always ask everybody if they have some. So I carry a couple bobby pins with me, you know, and, uh, you know, some of the girls, uh, they come to me a lot now because they know I have them, and some of them think it's cute. So, you know, I carry a couple bobby pins on me. Um, in this compartment, I'm going to take everything out. I just have a few band-aids, about five or six band-aids, and then a few, um alcohol prep pads you know for just for cleaning uh, I'm gonna put this little the top back on there but yeah I, ca I always carry a uh, first aid supplies with me no matter what there's a few band-aids in my wa band aids in my wallet so um, if I do forget my wallet I've got band-aids in here this always stays on my person whether it be in my bag or in my pocket always have it 
All right, moving on. Uh, start with the medium size pockets. I mean, contain compartments. Um, I have some super glue. I always have super glue on me because you know it's glue and it's super glue. So it could fix almost anything. I mean, you could use it for wounds too. Like I have sealed up uh, some large cuts with uh, super glue. I mean, like if I'm out in the bush and I get a cut from you know like a knife or a, a, a large thorn, which has happened to me before. I uh, just uh, you know hold it together. Have a friend. If I'm out with a friend, super glue it together, and I'm uh, just going with my day. I mean, it hurts like a hurts like crap, but I mean it it'll work. And then when you get home, you know you can do all that other good stuff. All right, so moving on. Uh, these two compartments right here, the medium size and the center uh, mini one, I have four cough drops, two in each. You know, just for people that are uh, having like throat problems if they're like uh, coughing a lot, you know. Always here to save the day. Throw in a, I'm like, hey, you want a cough drop? Yeah, sure. You know, it, it always works. I mean, I've used it many times before at school and out in um, public. People have uh, loved me for that. So, always have cough drops on me. Um, moving on down here, I'm not going to open it because it, it'll just pop out everywhere. But I have uh, uh, hair ties. And, you know, they're just like rubber bands. I mean, hair ties can work for anything. And also for the, the bobby pin reason, you know, girls are always asking for hair ties, and now they know they know I have them. I uh, just you know give them some hair ties, and I I uh, replenish that. I've got about six in there, so uh, every time if I if I there is one missing, I you know I always put one in there, you know, because my mom and she has like a ton, so you know I ask her, I'm like, yeah, can I have a couple of hair ties? And yeah, I gotta explain her the reason, but uh, she now knows that I do that, use that for that. So I just, you know, have about five or six hair ties in here. So, yeah. Uh, moving on over here. This is for uh, school reasons. I just didn't really want to take it out because it's kind of a hassle to keep up with. And they're dambits. Let me try to dump that out for you. I've got about, let's see, seven dambits in here. You know, it's for, I, I'm, I am in the junior ROTC program uh, at my high school. And these come in handy, you know. Uh, my fellow classmates, cadets, they, uh, a lot of them lose dambits, so I'm here to save the day. They always come to me for dambits if they see me in the hallway. Always have dambits on me, you know, just, you know, to save the day. And also for myself, too, I mean, I do lose dambits here and there, but that's what they're in there for. It's for our ROTC purposes, so, yeah. That's what I keep that dambits in there for. I keep cough drops for, you know throat problems, coughing and such. I uh, have hair ties for, you know, rubber bands holding things together and, you know, for the ladies. I do have super glue for first aid reasons and just for um, utility reasons. I have super glue. Uh, I, did, I used to have crazy glue, but that wouldn't fit in here, so I thought I'd just get some super glue, an old super glue, and, you know, throw it in there because it, it's nice and compact. It fits in there. Uh, it's, a, it's the regular size super glue, but it's been used a couple times by me. So, I thought I'd just, you know, grab that, throw that in there. I mean, it still works, so there's still plenty of glue in there. So, I just thought I'd throw that in there. And then, obviously, first aid supplies can be used for, obviously, first aid. And the alcohol swabs at the bottom, they can be used for uh, starting fires. Because, actually, earlier today, I mean, sorry, last night, I was uh, messing around with my flint striker, and I was uh, trying to... Just, uh, catch fire with a cotton ball and I thought why don't I just test that out on an alcohol swab so I laid one of them there and I striked it a couple times boom like perfectly on fire got my fire started very very nicely so uh, it's a good uh, tool to have on you if you try in your fire starting kit have uh, alcohol swabs uh, from you know first aid if you have uh, a bunch extra just throw that in there great little tool uh, it works very very well um, in that case, uh, this is the ending of my video. Hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, hope it gave you guys some ideas on an emergency preparedness kit or uh, EPK. Uh, if you guys have any questions on, um, you know, any ideas you uh, need to uh, make you one of these, you know, feel free to comment, uh, and I'll write you back or um, message me on YouTube. Feel free. Uh, please don't say anything rude, because you know nobody wants to hear that. Well, at least I'm pretty sure nobody wants to hear that on here. But, um, in that case, um, I hope you guys like the 
the video. I hope this gave you ideas. Uh, comment, subscribe. If you haven't subscribed, um, you know, share with your friends. Please do. I need a yep. lot more um, views for my stuff. Um, but this was Beastie1066 with a, another review. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Bye.